This facility in Leavenworth, operated by Core Civic, is the target of a letter from the ACLU. These are all people who are innocent. They are innocent until proven guilty under law. All at the Core Civic private detention facility in Leavenworth, where federal inmates are housed as they face charges. They are at risk of extreme violence every single day. Sharon Brett is the legal director for the ACLU of Kansas, a group that recently wrote a letter to the Biden administration calling for the facility to close by the end of the year. The letter calls the facility understaffed, poorly managed, and incapable of housing its detainee population. If your friend or your neighbor or your cousin or your brother was in there, would you care? And I think you would. Leavenworth police tell KNBC they've investigated at least two serious incidents this year. An inmate dying in February after an assault and two staff members hospitalized in August after an inmate assault. Meanwhile, Core Civic has fired back saying the ACLU's claims about understaffing and safety are false and defamatory, calling the ACLU statements biased since the group wants to end private prisons. A situation KNBC will continue to watch as the year comes to a close. In Leavenworth, Matt Fleener, KBC 9 News.